my clients came for a takedown and I just could not help but to record to show you guys what it looks like. Her appointment was September 15th and she came today, um, December 8th for a takedown for a knowledge goddess braid. On the left, that's like, you know, September 15th. And then on the right, that is like today, um, December 8th when she is taking down her braid. So when I do these styles, I do offer it take down and touch up, you know, because, you know, it takes a minute for you to take it down. It actually took me about three hours and 30 minutes to take it down a hair, but that's only because a hair is as long as the style. So she booked for a mid back and her hair is actually a mid back or a little bit past that. Because I told her that when you're taking your hair down, try not to cut too much because your hair is just as long. So I guess that was the main reason why she actually came to me to take it down. If your hair is like shorter, it's going to take less of time to take it down. But if your hair is like longer, then I kind of have to start at the, the tip before and then just work my way up. But if your hair was like shorter, I'll probably just cut it to like the middle or whatever or wherever, like before your hair stops and stuff. But hers just take me longer because again, she has longer hair, right? But if you have shorter hair, then it's not gonna take you as long because three hours is a long time to do like a takedown. But hey, it's done. And that's what it's looking like. So I asked her about like the maintenance and care. And I was like, what did you use? Because shoot, every time I see my clients, you know, when I hear that my clients kept their hair for like four months and three months and two months or even four weeks and six weeks, I'm always asking them, what did you use? So I can like recommend products like for like, you know, my clients or people that want to like know what they can use for the maintenance. So first she, she wasn't in the pool. She didn't, she wasn't like in the water. She would she told me that she actually like rinsed the hair but not like wash like with like shampoo and like, you know, scrub, scrub, scrub. Just simple rinse, just something simple, something light. No pool vibe, whatever. And then she used the Cantu leave-in conditioner and the water and oil mixtures. And then she used it for like, you know, to spray. And she told me she did the spray like every other day, right? So again, when you get your hair done, don't wait. If your goal is to have the hair last for you for like two months and three months and six weeks and seven weeks. Don't wait till like week two or week three for you to start doing your maintenance. You need to start ASAP because again, you have a goal for how long you want to keep it in, right? But if your goal is just four weeks or three weeks or I don't know, six weeks, then of course, like have fun. Don't do too much with it, right? But if your goal is longer, you need to kind of like start taking care of it because again, it's human hair, but you still have to spray. You still have to keep it moisturized and everything. And that's that's why our hair look the way it look right now like it's still very nice if i if i you know do like my nice um water oil and leave-in conditioner spray and then steam it she will be good to go it's gonna look nice and i'm actually going to attach a video where my clients came for a touch-up and because of i use the steam you cannot really tell which one is the new and the old curls because the steam is going to revive the curls right so if i had done the same thing for her she would be she would have been good to go but guess what her roots are already growing out so if your roots are growing out and you have like a colored braids it's going to look weird but if, she, if hers is like black i think she would have just you know do the edges swoop the edges and then she'll be good to go because I still have my braids in and it's been like four months. It's embarrassing to have mine for four months, but I've just been so busy with like doing my clients here. I don't have time for myself, but I plan on maybe like making a video to show you guys like my growth and everything. But yeah, here's the video that I was talking about. And again, let me know if you have any questions. The hair link, the hair link is in my description box and it is provided by Queen's Beauty Lounge. And I also have my Instagram in my description as well. Let me know if you found this video helpful. Oh yeah, and I mentioned, so if you wanna take the hair, if you wanna take the hair down, um, you can start by cutting the curls so you don't have like too many like roadblocks and while you're like taking down your braids, but, or you can just like thug it out and just start taking it out anyways. But if you want it to be easier for you, of course, um, just cut the curls out, just be careful. So the reason why I feel like people don't cut the curls is because it's kind of going to cut their natural hair and I get it, right? But if you can cut the curls out first before you start taking out the braids or else, you know, just rock with it and then, yeah, and then it's going to be out like easy peasy, no big deal. 
Okay, that'll be all for now. I hope this video was very helpful. And let me know if you guys have any questions. And hopefully when I'm taking my own um, goddess braids down, because I did mine in like August 8th <laughs> or 7th. When I'm taking mine down, I'll be sure to make a quick video. It's quite embarrassing. But honestly, after like putting on makeup and like doing my edges, it does look nice. It does look great. So yeah, I would just say if you want to keep your hair for long, just get this just get the same human hair color that matches your natural hair and you should be good to go for as long as you want. And even cut it at some point to a bob, rock it that way, and then take it out whenever you're ready to. Okay, guys, that's enough talking for today. Let me know if you have any questions, and I'll be seeing you guys in my next video. It's V Kills. Original, puffing on me high grade, sipping on me liquor. Girls, them I come, them I want, them I take her. Bad man, me I come in, me I wanna take her. Girls, them I come, them I want in on the liquor. I steady sipping on my liquor. Then I tell her me she give, I never trust another nigga. I say she give me on the nigga. Say she feeling on the nigga. Say she run another nigga. I who's that? Baby, tell me.